Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and if you're new here thank you for clicking onto this video I hope you click that subscribe button as well. So this is my part two of my clearing out my wardrobe. If you haven't seen part one where I did my main wardrobe here which has like tops, skirts and like blazers then I'll put the link down below but because this had a lot more going out dresses and like jumpsuits, play suits, coats, I thought it would be best to do it as a part two. Otherwise, that video would be like so long. So there's my intro. Let's go on to the video. This is my other kind of mini wardrobe for like longer stuff. So like coats and dresses. And at the bottom, I have like bags just because I have nowhere else to put them. But this is literally full to the brim. Like I can't put anything more in it. So I really need to clear this one out because I'm going to be honest, most of the dresses I'm never going to wear again probably. I literally just bought this the other day. Look how cute it is. Like I thought with like a pair of like boots and like the fishnets like socks. That would be such a cute outfit mate. Okay, most of this I'm keeping, keeping for work. This has a hole in it that I only recently found out when I wore to work and I was like damn. It's like a plain little boohoo like dress but... I can easily just get rid of it. I could sew it up, but I, it ain't that deep. So I'm going out on the weekend, and I can't decide between these two outfits. Like one is like a safety outfit, like dress, that I wear as a backup. I've also got in black, which is this red one here, which it's just long, and it's just kind of a plain dress, but it's just so safe. But then there's another one here that's quite similar, apart from it's silk, and it's got a slit. But I don't know how I feel looking in it. Like I have to see on the day. Because I do feel kind of fat in it. Like it is very clingy. And I look skinny in the other dress. But I'm going to bring them both and see. Haven't worn it yet. I saw it first. Which is a slightly see-through deck. But I told them not allowed to wear to work. Shirty dress. I am going to put it away. Because it's got a stain on it. So I'm going to throw it. Because it's got to stay. This constantly opens. It's like just a plain shirt like dress. But this button is forever opening. And I don't realise till I'm like walking halfway down the street. Then I'm like oh hello. Now I know where everyone's looking. Because my boobs are. I actually really love this. It is just a straight dress from Primer. Something has fallen. See this is why it's so packed. They keep falling off of their things. So I think it was on this one. This is just like an off the shoulder shirt. Not shirt. Like a t-shirt dress. That I do like, but it does make me feel kind of fat in it. I'll have to try it on again. Try it on again. It's from Misguided and C. Because I do like it, but I might have to just buy a different one. If that one makes me feel fat. I loved this dress from Everything £5. Like, it was just so cute. And I loved the little frilly bit at the bottom. And I wore it when I went to Ascot. But... It rises so much like it is quite tight on me and when I was walking like luckily I had my like long coat on and like it was cold so I could get away with wearing it constantly because I was literally naked like it was up here like there was nothing on my bottom like if I was to open up people I'd be flashing so to get rid what is this oh I haven't even worn this yet it's basically a red skirt and a crop top I've worn the crop top with like a pair of jeans but I really like it as you can see, it's very similar to the dress. It's just in two pieces. But you can see the kind of style I like when I go out. I'm going to keep it because I'm already it. It's super cute. I got this from Everything £5. And I believe it's actually from Pretty Little Thing. They got the tag. And it comes with like a choker. I have actually had to sew it here. Did a little botch job. I need booby tape with it though because... Maybe it's because I'm small boobed or something. But literally... It's like here. The straps are here. There's nothing covering. And like when I tied done it up, like I've like sewn it to make it a bit tighter, it has helped slightly, but I feel like I'm gonna need some booby tape. So I'm gonna have to maybe get booby tape, try it, because I haven't, but I love how it looks on it. Like my body looks win this. I actually got this dress, it's just a long dress. I got it from eBay. I think it was like two pounds. And I got it and I love it. Like I wear it in the summer and I just feel like I look so nice it makes because of obviously the style here makes my waist look a bit skinnier and i just really like it but i got it from ebay and i was like yes oh i've had this dress for so long i think it's forever 21 it is and i do really like it it's just like a little skaterish kind of dress but it's just too short for me now like my butt is forever out i've got to keep worrying so let's just get 
rid of that. See, because it's so crowded, I've got so many dresses that I've bought that have the tag. You'll find most of these still have the tag on because it's so packed out, I just don't wear them because I can't find anything. I just go for the same ones because they're in my wash pile and I just wear those constantly because I can see them. This is just, oh, this is actually really cute. It's just a red, like, high neck, short sleeved one. That would be perfect for work and it's still got the tag on it. It's a bit low cut though. That's why I'm gonna need that black blazer. That's why I need the black blazer. So yeah, I'm gonna wear that. I might wear that this week. Oh, I love this. This is my favorite. Oh my God, has it got stains on it? It's got stains. <gasps> it's got stains on it. I'm gonna have to put the, oh no, look. Look at this. I'm gonna have to get some dads. It's got stains because this is my favorite freaking skirt, dress, but I love this. Yeah, I got it from H&M. Oh no, it does go this way. I just loved it so much. I wore it to death in the summer, hence why it's got so many stains. But it's just the perfect little cute white dress to just throw on with a pair of sandals and you look cute AF. I've said cute so many times, but yeah, I love it. I don't care. I'll put some dazzle on that so I get those stains out because I love it so much. This actually isn't mine. It is my friend's. <laughs> I should probably not throw it away because it's not mine. It's just a long jumpsuit with this little frilly bit. I should probably give this back. <laughs> I love this place this is like the only play suit that i've ever worn out honestly it looks so cute with a tan and like long hip like long knee-high boots that's how i wear it and i look super cute in it i'm gonna wear it definitely wow i've got like no clothes i'm gonna have to do a serious shop i actually really love this i loved how i looked on it it's like a tie-up fray dress and so it looks like that and it's just a long blue it was just a color i never went for i just loved it i loved how i looked i felt so elegant on holiday but it did open up a lot and you could flash and everyone was seeing vagina, but it's perfect for holidays and stuff, so I'll wear it again for them. Why haven't I worn this? This is like perfect for work. I don't think I like the look of it on me. I did wear it a few times. It's time to get rid of it. I forgot I had it, so it's not that deep. I wore this for a mate's 21st and it was so, I loved how I looked in it. Like it's just like a mesh and you do technically probably need something to cover up the nips, but I didn't and it just looks so nice and I didn't get any cute photos in it so I can wear it again I'm gonna wear it again however it did because I didn't have any tape on the nips did chafe me a bit not gonna lie oh my god I forgot about this is that a stain because bitch I have not worn this I don't think I bought this and I haven't worn it but if I remember correctly I think it was way too small I don't think I could get my ass in it I'll have to see I wear this all the time I should probably wear this again for work. It's just, it's so weird, you know, because it's got like the roll neck, so it keeps me warm here, but then it has no sleeves, so then I get cold, but it's like woolly. <sighs> I'll wear it for work. So this is my Sandy jumpsuit. You know, at the end of Greece, when she's looking all smoking hot in the outfit, and he's all like, this is how I feel in this. I actually feel super cute in it. I'm gonna wear it again. Oh, this is my Ralph Lauren, or Lauren, however you pronounce it, t-shirt, no, like shirt dress. I really like it on. But one of those materials, you know those ones that you have to iron every time after? Like, and that's why I just never want it purely out of laziness. But it looks really nice on it. It would be perfect for like work and stuff. Okay, screw it. I'm going to wear it. I'm going to wear it. I'm going to iron it. Don't be a lazy bitch, Jazz. Like, don't be a lazy bitch. This still has the tag on. It's one of those like, so it's high neck. It's like, and it's got like really long and it goes really long down on one side of the leg and the other leg is like higher. I loved the colour of it. I think I felt fat in it though, because it was clingy, so you could see all my rolls. I think that's why it's still got the tag on. I'll try it on and see. Otherwise, I'm gonna sell it. Look, most of my dresses still have the tag on, yet here I am buying another dress, that red dress I bought literally two days ago or something, because I needed an outfit. Yeah, I've got tags on all of these. This is very similar to the other black meshy dress apart from it's long sleeved and like the pattern here is a bit different but it's still super cute like girl wear this oh i remember this dress i can't even really show you what it looks like because it's so weird so it's like a cross back and i think it's low at the front and it's low at the back i just hated how i looked in it but you know when you can't be able to return one item but I really didn't feel confident in it at all. Yeah, that one I'm selling. Oh, I loved this dress. If this was my Christmas dress, not last year, the year before. It's just so cute. I'm gonna wear it to work now. This dress 
I loved how I looked in it but the material is so heavy but the style of it obviously you can see it goes here so you look a lot skinnier and because it was so tight I think it might be a size six or an eight but because it was also so tight my boobs look really psh. but I really did like it on and I didn't get any cute pictures in it so maybe uh I don't think I'm gonna fit in it though it is stretchy material I'll try but I think I might just look ridiculous but it was so expensive it was like 60 odd quid for this dress I'm like <laughs> that's a lot of money personally for me to buy on a dress but for something I'm gonna wear once which I literally only did wear it once two years ago I'll try it on if not I'll sell it because it is really nice on and it makes your figure look bomb this is from the same company it's so heavy like literally so heavy it's still got the tag on why the fuck did I buy it I'll try it on but I think the reason I didn't wear it was because it's just so heavy <laughs> If not me, I've got to sell that. This dress is another dress that I threw up on and I realised that I'm not allowed to wear white stuff because uh, by the end, I didn't realise until uh, the next morning I looked at it and it had makeup, fake tan, drink, puke probably, like, ugh. Dad managed to save it. But I did really like it on. Like, I like how I felt in it. Like, like I said, the, as you can see, very similar to like my red dress. They're just my safety dresses that I know look good on me and they look all right, you know? So I'll keep it as a backup dress. I wore this dress for a wedding. I didn't like myself in it, but I wore it for a wedding. So I've never been to a wedding before and I was like, oh my God, what do you wear to weddings? So we can, we can sell that. It's from Boohoo. A black version of the red dress. Again, how many times do I have to say it? It's a safety dress of mine. So I will be keeping it. Oh, I loved the distress. It was so cute and you literally, oh look, it was just like a white and pink and it like goes down slightly and there's a diagonal here it was just so cute like why don't i wear it anymore what size is it i really did like this i should probably try wear it again i'm gonna wear it again did i even have a picture in it i think i did and i it was about three years ago that's how long i've had it another dress that i wore for my friend's 18th i think and i'm literally about to go to her 22nd like next month so that's how long I've had this dress. Where's it from? This guy did. I'm probably never going to wear it again. It was super cute though, but I'm never going to wear it again. I don't even think I could fit it again. So let's sell this. A plain black skater dress. You can't really go wrong with those, can you? It's just like a backup and you just wear it with a pair of that. That's all my dresses. As you can see, most had tags. Okay, finally we're on to a few jackets and a few more blazers that are in here. I got like a long, what is this, a boyfriend, boy, boyfriend, a boyfriend blazer, it's in grey, mm, I'm never gonna wear it, never gonna wear it, let's sell it, this is like a little raincoat, I think it's from Jigsaw, it's like a little plain raincoat, I don't own any raincoats, maybe I should try this on, I'll try it on and see, but I don't actually own any raincoats, these two are like from my mum's stuff, from like years ago that she like made and stuff, I didn't put that in here. This was also her leather jacket that she gave me because she couldn't fit anymore. But she's lost weight now, like she's skinnier than me, so maybe she'll want that back. It's like pure leather as well, like it's legit leather. It just isn't my type of leather jacket, you know? And finally, I've got a bomber jacket. I'm not gonna wear it. I feel like a security guard in it. Like I know bomber jacks, uh, bomber jacks, bomber jackets are like puffy. This one was just way too puffy, and I felt like a proper like bleh, security guard, so. Let's sell it. I do own other jackets, but they're hanging up on my door, but I actually use all of them. That's why they're on my door, because they're my go-tos. And that's it, it's all cleared out, sorted. It's like so empty now, and it's like, it's just like nothing in it now. It's got so much room. It's a lot better though, isn't it? Now that it's all cleared out. So that is everything in my dress, jacket, wardrobe that i've now cleared out oh i feel so much better i hope you enjoyed my little clear out week series that i just did of my two wardrobes if you like this video and you like more like organizing videos and clearing out ones because i've got like skincare makeup shoes bags so much that i need to clear out like it's becoming a joke now then please let me know in the comments below and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and if you haven't already please subscribe i upload videos every monday and thursday and i shall see you next time bye hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and if you're new here thank you oh, 